So Jesse and I are always trying to assess and evaluate how well we're parenting. I only have one minute, I'm going to counseling. One thing that we've been talking a lot about lately is not raising our boys in a home that feels like it's constantly on fire. So let me elaborate a little bit. So I am not the most organized person in the world. Um, I'm late, I try not to be, I have gotten better. We have noticed that there are moments when our house feels like it's on fire and you might be able to relate. There's chaos and you're like rushing your kids out the door and everything's stressful. You didn't finish homework the night before so you need to get it done. Lack of rhythm or routine or structure makes our children feel like they're growing up in a home where there's always an emergency. They're going to start living in that place of anxiety and of stress because they feel like they're always 10 steps behind. But when we're intentional to create those rhythms and routines, which I just don't have in some areas of my life, and, and when we're willing to teach our kids how to create those things for themselves, it's really, really helpful to the home in order to quench those fires. A few things that I've done and then I have to go is one, I've created a list for my boys morning and night. I had them write it out. They were really excited about what their routine looks like from the second they wake up to go when they go to school and then for when it's time to get ready for bed and to prepare for the next morning and then I also need to prepare on my end what my morning is going to look like to be the most effective helpful mom while also remaining calm and patient with my kids it's funny that I'm recording this as I'm late to an appointment because this is just an example of what I'm working on I want my kids to grow up in a house that is structured and feels like most importantly above all a very safe place for them where they can come to receive godly wisdom and love just to feel like they can hide from the world in our home if they need to not a place of stress and pressure and unease I just want to share that with you guys if you feel similarly or if you have tactics or things that you do please share them because I am in the process of learning